Awesome. So what about now the close button here? How do we make it work? Well, to do that, what we can do is go here to the button. This is where we define um, this closing button here. And we will implement a click listener. And we will create a method which will be called close window, which we will call from here. So let's add a close window method. And in here, we will get a hold of the NW done window dot get. So this is a reference to the window object inside of the NW environment. Cool. And now all we have to do is let's move this out here. and implement the close method here. We'll save this file and let's reload the app and we'll notice the nasty error here. Um, it says NW is not defined. My understanding here is that we need to let NW know that we will allow the HTML script um, files or script tags to call NW processes or node stuff on this side of the application, if that makes sense. And so to accomplish that, we will go back to the package.json file and add yet another entry here, which will be node-remote and node-remote will expect a path, um, more like a domain name or an IP address of the hosts that we want to allow to um, our application to use the Node API. In our case, we want to enable everything from what we're doing in our application. So to make these changes work, we need to kill the app again and fire it up. Once it loaded, we can see this still works and then we can close that window. Alright. Similarly, you can implement your own minimize or full screen or maximize. We're just not doing that here. We're only using this close button. Okay, so I think that wraps up our changes that we want to make on this package JSON under the launch um, folder. And next we can continue by adding npm modules to the application so we can actually ping some remotes and be able to change the status and show it here. So let's do that next.